Hello everyone and welcome back to our channel. Today we are going to talk about how to use simplybook.me. In this video we will talk about simplybook.me, its features, its membership plans, the sign up and account setup processes and we will also do a walkthrough of the interface and we will also demonstrate for you how a user can book services from your website. So watch this video till the end to better understand all these steps. Simplybook.me is one of the world's leading appointment scheduling solutions with tens of thousands of paying customers around the globe. Simplybook.me offers a booking solution for smaller service-based businesses as well as enterprises with many locations. Simplybook.me provides online booking system for all service-based industries. Simply define your services and providers display their availability and you will have clients both old and new making bookings 24-7. The main features of simplybook.me are accept online bookings, notifications via SMS email, client and admin app, accept payments, integration and API, and custom features. Now let's see the pricing and different membership plans. Click on the pricing tab in the top navigation bar. This is the pricing page. Simplybook.me has five membership plans. First is the free plan, which is obviously free. And in this, you will get up to 50 bookings per month, one custom feature and one user or provider. Second is the basic plan, which is at $9.9 per month. And in this, you will get up to 100 bookings per month, three custom features and five users or providers. Third is the standard plan, which is very popular and you can get it at $29.9 per month. And in this, you will get up to 500 bookings per month, 8 custom features and 15 users or providers. Fourth is the premium plan, which is at $59.9 per month. And in this, you will get up to 2000 bookings per month, unlimited custom features and 30 users or providers. And the fifth and the last one is the premium plan, which is at $99.9 per month. And in this, you will get up to 5,000 bookings per month, unlimited custom features, and 60 users or providers. Now, let's get started. If you already have a simplybook.me account, then use this login button on the top right side to log in. Or else, click on the sign up button to create an account. This is the sign up page. Here enter your company login which will be the part of the URL and it cannot be changed. After writing the name, if the green tick sign appears, that means this login name is available. Otherwise, you need to keep trying. Next, here enter your email address. Next, select your country code and then enter your phone number. Next, choose your business's category. In the drop-down menu, you will see that there are many categories and subcategories. Select any one that best suits your business. Next, you need to enter your company's location. Next, you have to enter the booking page title like your company's name. Now here, write a short description about your company. Now tick this box to agree to the terms and conditions. Tick this box to subscribe for latest features. And if there's any recapture, then solve it. And once you have filled all the fields, then click on the sign up now button. Now your company's page will be created. And after that, you have to verify your email address. Here enter the six digit code and then click on the verify and continue button. On the next page from here, you have to set up your account in three steps. This is the first step. Here enter your name, then create a password here confirm it here and finally click on the let's go button. This is the second step and from here you need to select a theme for your website. Scroll down and you will see that there are many themes based on different categories. You can choose any one that best suits your business. Here we are continuing with this theme. So hover your cursor on it and then click on the choose theme button. This is the third and last step. In the first section from here, pick your preferred color combination. You can select any one from the given combinations. In the second section, you will see the suggested features that are available for your website. In the third section, you will be asked, how many service providers or employees do you have? 
use this slider to adjust the number. In the fourth section, you will be asked how many services does your company provide? Again, use the slider to adjust the number and then finally click on the magic button. After this, your booking website will be created and you will be taken to this page. Here you have two options. From here, you can visit your booking website and from here you can go to the settings page and your dashboard. First, we will go to the settings page and after that, we will have a look at our booking website. So click on the go to settings button. This is your dashboard. In the left side, you will see data and highlights for booking today, booking this week and workload this week. And here you will find your upcoming bookings and recently added bookings. In the left sidebar, you will have tabs of dashboard, welcome, calendar, marketing suite, manage, reports, custom features, settings, plans and prices, and help. Click on the manage tab and select the services. From here, you can add and edit the services of your booking. Now let's have a look at our booking website. Click on my booking channels on the top right corner and then click on my booking website. Your website will open in a new window. So this is our booking website. You can add and modify all these details by using the different tabs on your dashboard. On the top, you will have three tabs, which are home, review and my bookings. Below in the left side, you will see the opening hours section. And in the center, you will see your booking company's name and a description that we had written during the sign up process. And in the right side, you will see the contact us section, which shows your phone number, email address, your company's address and the website. Now let's demonstrate how a user can book your services. Click on the book now button. Users can book services on your website in just three simple steps. This is the first step in which you have to select the service which you want to book. This is the second step in which you have to select the date and time. From here, select the date and from below, select the available start times. Now in the third and last step, you have to confirm your details. Here enter your name, then here enter your email address and lastly enter your phone number here. And in the right side, you will see the details of your booking like service, date, time and supplier. And once you have filled all the details and checked your booking, then tick this box to accept the terms and conditions and finally click on the confirm booking button. After successfully confirming your service, the user will also see a success message that says you've successfully reserved the service. Please check your email to see the notification. Below are the details of the booking and from this button, the user can cancel this booking. From this button, the user can book more services and lastly from here, the user can add it to their calendar. So with this, we have completed our tutorial on how to use simplybook.me. This brings this video to an end. We truly hope you liked it. If you have any suggestions or want us to make a video on any specific topic, feel free to comment below. We will see you soon in our next video. Till then, stay tuned and stay subscribed to our channel.